Amerigon currently supplies climate control seat technology in the form of two miniature heat pumps. One of each of these devices is mounted in the seat cushion and the back. So we have two devices with an electronic controlling device that manages the energy to the thermoelectrics and the power to the fan. The fans themselves draw in the cabin air, push that air through the thermoelectric where it is thermally treated, heated or cool, based upon the seat occupant's requirements. The unwanted thermal energy, which is also produced anytime you energize a thermoelectric circuit, is exhausted back into the cabin. So by mounting two of these devices in the seats, we're able to actively heat and cool air and then direct that air up to the seat occupant in the seat surfaces. These uh, thermoelectric heat pumps that make up the elements of the climate control systems primarily consist of a miniature fan that is mounted thusly in the cabin, and there is usually a filter on top of these, and it also consists of a thermoelectric heat pump which is sandwiched between these two sets of copper fins. Once an occupant gets in the car, turns on the ignition, sets his selected temperature, the process of heating and cooling the seat surface takes about two minutes. So in extreme conditions, when you get in your car in the winter, you turn on the device, within two minutes you begin to feel warm air coming up around your body. In the summertime, when it's extremely warm, you get in the car, you turn on the device, you feel cool, dry air blowing up against your back and legs within two minutes of engine on.